Every year, northern India suffers devastating forest fires. One cause for the fires is the trees themselves. Following the monsoons, the forest floors are covered with thousands of tons of pine needles. A spark is enough to set them afire. But one man had an idea. Because there's so much fire every year, we realize that there is a potential there, there is energy there. Can we harness that energy? And that's what sent us in the direction of generating some kind of usable energy from pine needles. Rajneesh Jain developed a small power plant that produces electricity with energy-rich pine needles. The needles leave little residue when they're burned and produce temperatures of more than 800 degrees Celsius. Now, 20 houses in the village are supplied with 120 kilowatts of clean energy. Essential oils account for the especially hot fire. Jane has established a foundation to build the power plants in wooded areas without power sources. Today, the entire village collects the valuable raw material. But it wasn't always that way. These guys are paying us for collecting pine needles, so they must have lost their nuts and bolts somewhere, you know. And literally it was like that. They were laughing at me. The pine needle power plant has changed the entire village. The local Avani weaving mill can now operate regardless of the weather. Avani was always famous for its fabrics, but now the local mill produces enough to employ 15 people. When there is more reliable access to electricity in these remote areas, it will drive the rural economy. Thanks to Rajneesh Jain's idea, the problematic pine needles have become a sustainable source of energy.